Greetings, friends of First Lutheran Church. This is Pastor Lars inviting you to worship with us this weekend at First Lutheran, either in person or through our broadcast ministries. Reminding you also that at the 11 o'clock service on Sunday, we will be at McKinnon Park, followed by our annual church picnic. So please come bring a chair and join us out there if we have nice weather. This weekend, we are going to be preaching again at the end of Ephesians. As we've been going through this summer, we're now completing two things. The book of Ephesians, as well as John chapter 6, where Jesus has been talking about him being the bread of life. But in Ephesians chapter 6, we hear now about wearing the whole armor of God. And I think about sometimes when I've gotten into fights and we get very defensive and we're worried that somebody's going to come and just crush us with a blow and we get into a defensive posture like wearing armor, hiding behind a shell, But what Ephesians tells us is that the fight isn't ours. The fight has been won for us in Jesus Christ. And putting on Christ in baptism, we now wear him. He is our protection against the spiritual forces of doubts and uh, lies. And he covers us with all sorts of protection in every area so that we can stand within the fight, not fighting back, but giving his word so others receive also this holiness, this righteousness, this protection that comes in Jesus Christ. So the last part of uh, the armor that we put on is shoes that aren't just for protection, but they're anything that gives us the ability to go and give the gospel to others. And we're going to be talking a bit about what it means to be sharing in the faith together as a congregation what it means to be conversing with one another, listening for people's uh, worries, where they're going to get crushed and blown over, and how we support them with this word of God that says we stand here together as children of God, as people chosen in Christ to withstand the wiles and worries and forces that are out there to get us with just one simple little thing, the word of of Jesus Christ, our Lord, who has given his life for us. So come, join us this weekend as we hear this great news for us, this news that we are God's own chosen people in Christ. We'll see you there.